In a bold move, the United States has imposed sanctions on 16 key allies of Venezuelan, President Nicolas Maduro. The decision comes in response to allegations of voter fraud in the July 28, 2024 presidential election, which sparked international outcry and raised concerns about the legitimacy of the results. The sanctions were triggered by Maduro's government's actions against Edmundo Gonzalez, who was recognized by the U.S. and other nations as the legitimate winner of the election. Gonzalez fled to Spain after a warrant was issued for his arrest, leading to further doubts about the fairness of the electoral process. High-profile officials, including Supreme Court President Carizlia, Rodriguez Electoral Council Director Rosalba Gil, and National Assembly Vice President Pedro Infante have been targeted with these sanctions. They are accused of playing roles in both the electoral fraud and the subsequent repression of opposition figures, adding weight to the allegations against Maduro's government. U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken has also announced visa restrictions on officials aligned with Maduro's regime. However, the Biden administration has chosen not to impose new sanctions on Venezuela's crucial oil industry. This has raised questions about the overall impact of these measures as concerns mount about spiking global oil prices and the potential worsening of Venezuela's already struggling economy, which could lead to increased migration to the U.S. The purpose of these sanctions is to pressure Maduro to engage in negotiations and resolve Venezuela's ongoing political crisis. International observers continue to call for transparency and accountability in the election process, with hopes of fostering change and stability in the region. Despite these actions, many Venezuelans feel disillusioned as their hopes for change dwindle. The impact of these sanctions combined with the cautious approach of the Biden administration, leaves uncertainties about the future trajectory of Venezuela's political landscape.